Everybody's seen this because niggas did a hundred videos about this shit. But we're going to play it over again because I, I want to put a, a different spin on this shit too real quick. So. You're reading? Uh, yeah, I, I was actually reading. Um, I, I ship out in a few days, so I was just reading The Artist Strategy. Okay. Um, Is that the military? <laughs> Uh, yeah, so actually, I'm a nuclear physicist for the Navy, no. so I, I do that in a few in a few days. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Okay. How old are you? I am 27. I look a little young. I'm not. I'm not that young. Yeah, you look young. So, where do you live? Uh, so I'm actually in the Woodlands, Texas, right now. Um, right, right down there by Houston. I'm about 30 minutes away from Houston, so I'm a little close. Oh. Nice. Okay, so tell me a little bit about yourself. Um, man, where do I start? Uh, I like uh, I like martial arts a lot. I did uh, a bit of pharmacy uh, back when I was a little bit younger, about two, three years ago. I got certified at pharmacy around when I was seventeen. Um, I didn't really do anything with it. I went to university for a while. I was getting like a business degree, so I have a bachelor's in business. And then I did um, pharmacy for a little while, for about three years, and then got bored. So I was like, eh, let's go see what the military has to offer. Didn't do anything. Um, got my, I did my PiCat about a year ago, got a 96 on that. It goes up to a 99, got a 96. They offered me nuclear physics, and I was like, why the fuck not? So I went there, and now I ship out in a few days. Oh, okay, nice. Well, best of luck. As you ship out pineapples. Damn. Why? Because he literally didn't tell me any qualities about himself. He's just like, I made a 96 on this. Okay. Y'all, y'all heard everything. Y'all, y'all know about the pineapple shit. Let me I want to use that as an example. First of all, women have horrible discernment. Don't listen to no motherfucking female intuition shit. Don't believe, don't listen to nothing bitches say with clothes on. They just dumb. I'm about to give y'all a perfect example of dumb. Black women loved me until I, until I started talking. Because I got tired of listening to their story about childhood, great, what they want to be when they grow up, how many kids they want. I got tired. Of, at some point, I wanted to talk about something other than what I like to do. Because the only reason they asked me what I like to do is because they wanted me to pay for the entertainment. Right? I told y'all all the time, nigga, how I, my mute game was crazy, nigga. Let her talk for 45 minutes. Mute game was crazy. By the time that I decided to talk, I was in my 30s. I had been fucking since catch a girl, freak a girl. By the time I actually told a girl what I thought, I was in my 30s. And all the girls was like, oh, my God, I hate you. You should never be around children. You should I never have a kid back. You could be stepdad to another nigga kid, but I never have a kid back. All that shit horrible human beings right this is what i want to explain because women don't know good men they don't they think they do they put the niggas that could be halfway good in a friend zone why they fuck a nigga that's still cologne in the fucking walgreens parking lot but bitches don't know good men because they're dumb people now and plus they need that control fix they don't let me tell you about me by all accounts to another man i'm a good man to another man to women i'm horrible but to to men i'm a good man think about what i am intrinsically not not who i am what i am intrinsically you talking about he scored a 96 on the test only go to 99 i got a 33 on my act without studying and only go to 36 i was like damn if i did a pretest, i probably would have got a 35 nigga i got a 163 iq on fucking brilliant man let me show y'all something nigga i'm an alpha a five man shout out to the alphas man y'all got me through college i'm a mason you know what i'm saying Got them a man in, in high regard, outstanding member. You know what I'm saying? Got them a man. I wrote 11 books, but I got two different pages. And then I wrote kids' books under the name Mr. Acorn, so it don't pop up under under my author page. But I need to figure out how to link that shit. Um, and I did movies, but I reason and I did the courses. 
but I want to show y'all the movie because the movie is what girls want. Girls want dirty folks. This is the movie Shots Fired. This is on Pluto TV. Y'all can see this shit. You know what I'm saying? This is this is a real movie on Pluto. Um, check this out. Let me show y'all something. I'm fucking up really bad right now. Oh god. All right. Um. Oh, this phone ring. Okay, that's cool. All right. Everyone, move in now. It's a hit. You see that handsome gentleman right there? You see that stud right there sticking up the motherfucking bar telling niggas they better pay him in pussy or something? You see that young husband? That is, that is me younger. It's that sexy ass nigga that was fucking all the IG models. That 20% nigga that y'all complain that only fuck Pookie. I might as well be Pookie. That nigga, let me look at this nigga again, man. Let me look at young me. Oh, my God. All I want to do is get the money. This bitch wouldn't give up the money. You know what's so, so mad about this, though? I don't have a key to say. What don't you understand? Pookie! 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 Pookie!
What do you want, black man? You're free now. Civil rights. EEOC Act. What do you want? I just want a woman. An ability to fuck white women. I just want to fuck. That's why y'all niggas lose. Y'all got no goals, man. Because y'all have no culture. Y'all just believe in women, gays, and felons. Because that's all black is. Black ain't for heterosexual, tawny, and swarthy, men. Black is for women, gays, and felons. Who y'all march for? Women, gays, and felons. Who y'all protest for? Women, gays, and felons. Who do they finance? Women, gays, and felons. God damn it. Who did they not want to see eat? Black men. Plan for black America? What about the women, gays, and felons? Fuck the men. They don't deserve shit. Fuck you, Ice Cube. You tried to help a man. Goldman Sachs, $10 billion. Nothing for black women. You ain't heard a goddamn word. Can't wait till I get my cut. Y'all niggas sleeping with the enemy. I also sleep with the enemy. The difference is at least I know they the enemy. I spoon with bitches all the time. They be like, oh, so romantic. I ain't romantic, bitch. I'm holding you to make sure you don't move, bitch. I don't trust you. Y'all niggas is crazy. Goddamn right, XL Pro. Holes and clothes. It's all these niggas on. Money, holes, cars, and clothes. Anyway, I ain't gonna hold y'all. That's all I was really on today. I wanted to share these four little things with you. And hold on, man. Y'all, y'all don't know this cat. It's a dude on my timeline. For those of my Facebook friends, it's a dude named Murdoch. L. I don't know where the fuck you got the L from because the nigga BD, he ain't even no stone. But Murdoch L was a, the, the party promoter for uh Adriana, the club Adriana's, right? Murdoch's partner was this, this dude who happened to be GD named Great Lakes. This is Lakes. If y'all really knew the players in this scene, bro, like, not her. I don't know who she is, but I need to. Um, all these six, this, damn, I forgot this crazy bitch name. All she do is pop pills and suck dicks. She was trying to give me some pussy, too. Um, I can't remember my fucking name. But she's a rapper slash model. Everybody, every chick in this movie is rapper slash models. I'm going to put this shit on mute real quick. Can I put it on mute? Rapper slash models. Um, I think, I think her name was Janine Janae or some shit. Um, but every motherfucker in this bitch is a rapper slash uh, I did kill that bitch, though. Shout out to me. You know what I'm saying? Killing bitches on film and real life, nigga. I'm about that life, nigga. I'm about that motherfucking life. You know what I'm saying? If you can't penalize them, you don't need them, my nigga. Um, anyway, that's all I was going to say about that, man. As always, man, love each other as you love yourself. Feed the pack. Hold on, I do got one more thing to say. After this commercial break, I do got one more thing to share with y'all. Finish all this commercial. Come right back. 